Welcome back to Broadcast from the Future. This is the last speaker of the evening. I'm here with Nick. Hi, Nick. Hello. Hi. Thanks for hi. having me. Could you please introduce yourself to the people at home? Yeah, sure. So my name is Nick Rosa and I work at Accenture. I lead the extended reality and metaverse business for Europe and Asia Pacific in Accenture Technology Innovation. Hmm. And I'm part of this new group that we created, which is called the Metaverse Business Group at Accenture and I'm part of the leadership. All right. Um, how did you end up at Future Entrepreneurship 2022? I actually been invited by some of my colleagues at the Liquid Studio at Accenture here uh, in the, the, you know, Benelux. Mm -hmm. And uh, I actually flew back from my holiday. I was on a holiday, but I thought it was so important to, you know, let students understand the opportunities of this emerging technology, uh, the metaverse we're talking about that was worth, you know, taking a flight, breaking my holiday and come back here to talk to you. Yeah, it's absolutely amazing that you wanted to do all of that just to come talk here and inspire the next generation. Thank you so much for that. Absolutely, a pleasure. So, like, you're here, we've been through almost the whole evening. What, what did you think about it? Wow, it's absolutely impressive. Uh, I have to say that I was totally unprepared by the size of the event, the quality of the event, and the quality of the speakers as well. The production is top notch and I have to say that I've been speaking at Mobile World Congress and AWE and Oculus Connect. This is uh, pretty much worth booking if, you, if you're interested in those kind of events. It's a really, really good event. All right. Um, you're here with Accenture tonight. Um, what's your favorite part about your job at the moment? Oh, uh, discovering all the different parts of Accenture because Accenture is a big place. So. I'm connecting the dots between the metaverse and all the different parts of Accenture. Technology, uh, interactive, uh, strategy and consulting, uh, and also, you know, talking to people. I'm a storyteller, so I like to, uh, you know, evangelize people about the metaverse, about the opportunities, but also the risks, which is also important to do, because people need to be aware that we have to do this thing responsibly in all the different parts of the business that we're, you know, tackling with this technology. All right. Um, why do you think it's important that events like this exist as, as well as inspiring the next generations of young professionals? It's super important. I mean, uh, I wish I had events like this when I was at university, which was like a million years ago. <laughs> uh, but, you know, you can find colleagues to exchange ideas and eventually create new companies. Uh, you can be inspired by people on stage. You can get that spark of idea that is going to generate the next billion dollar business. Uh, it's super, super important, but also it's important to keep having fun because as long as you're young and you're a student, it's uh, important to realize and understand that failure is part of the game. And from failures and from learning come the learning. And from the learning come the big opportunity and you know the future of your career. So yeah, uh, be inspired be bold and you know keep going and inventing and breaking stuff. All right, also one thing I noticed today is how passionate you are about your job. I'm certain I'm not the only one that has noticed it, um, but like, what's the one thing you want the audience members to remember about your keynotes? <laughs> uh, think about the consequences of your business when you're building something, positive and negative. All right. the, cons the, 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 the key message is create technology and innovation in a responsible way because this world needs a little bit of tender and care from everybody, I think. All right. Then as last one, little surprise. Go for it. We're going to have a lightning round. Um, I'm going to give you two choices. Yeah. You have to don't think too long and just pick one you like the best as fast as possible. Yeah. All right. Ready? You like, go. All right. Interview or interviewee? Interview. Leader or follower? Leader. Leader? Logic or emotion? Logic. <laughs> Beach or the mountains? Beach. Beer or cocktails? Cocktails. Vegetarian or meat eater? Cannibal. <laughs> and the last one, more money or more time? Oh, uh, say again, what's that? More money or more time? More time. More time? All right. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you. Seeing as you want some more, I'm going to let you head out. Pleasure. Have a nice rest of the evening, and thank you for being with us, Nick. Thanks, everybody.